Hey fams, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. So today I'm going to be giving you guys a clean and decorate with me marathon. I hope that this helps you and inspires you to get up and do some spring cleaning. This is going to be the last and final spring video from me. The next videos that you guys will see will be summer time decorating and I have a few changes that I'm going to be making. So thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the video and enjoy the music and I will see you guys next time. Bye. You said that you needed me Like a cargo, you were carrying me Left 
behind The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind Ooh, On this road that I am on I gotta stay here for some time Somehow made it through without losing sight mm -hmm. And I still wonder where you are And if you found a way out from the dark The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind mm -hmm. This road that I am Gotta stay here for some time
Okay, you guys, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you gained some kind of inspiration from it um, to start, you know, maybe trickling some spring into your home. Um, I used all the stuff that I had in my home. I I shot my home and I didn't purchase anything for this particular project. So I hope that you guys um, gain some inspiration, you know, that you can shop your home and use the things that you already have in your space. You don't have to go out and buy a bunch of things. Um, you know, just because the trends are out there don't mean that you have to spend all the money because let's face it, nobody is decorating or <laughs> redecorating their home every single day, purchasing one thing and then, you know, have it up for a week and then purchase something new to replace it. I know that I'm not doing that and I know that you guys are probably not doing that either. Um, but I love the way that it turned out. And if you guys thought that I was going to choose the third one, you are absolutely right. I love the way that it turned out. Y'all know I am not a minimalist. I am a maximalist. And for me, more is more. So I absolutely love the way that this turned out. I love the floral arrangements. I love all the wood tones and all the warmth and the moodiness that it brings to my living space. And I can't wait to really start diving in to spring and start decorating our space. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video today and thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate you guys taking the time out of your busy day to spend a few minutes with me. It means the world. So I will see you guys next time and I hope that you guys have a wonderful and blessed day. Remember that Jesus is Lord. He loves you and I love you too. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye guys. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. Today's video is a different kind of a video. Today I'm going to be decorating my living room for the spring season, but I'm just going to be doing some cleaning before I get into decorating because y'all my house is a mess from top to bottom <laughs> okay um because I've been working so much I have not had the time to really clean my house um and so I'm just starting in the living room and I am going to be changing out all the covers on the pillows and the blankets and vacuuming and doing all the things so definitely definitely watch the video from beginning to end if you want to see how um I decorated this space I know some some of you are not about the cleaning um, and I know some of you are but I just wanted to incorporate this into one video and um, kind of show you guys how I got to the results so if this is the content that you guys like um, and if you're new here I normally do decorating and seasonal decorating on my channel um, if that's something you're interested in I do upload every Wednesdays and Fridays um, at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and I would love for you to consider subscribing becoming a part of our family here definitely double tap that bell so you don't miss out on any episodes so I'm going to let you guys enjoy the music and hopefully y'all get some inspiration from it um, you know cleaning your home or decorating your space for the spring season as well by the way y'all this curtain it was giving me the business it 
it really was. Um, so I'm going to let you guys go ahead and listen to the music and enjoy. And I will jump back in in a little bit. Don't forget when life comes us, Just call on me. diving headfirst into spring i'm loving it the sun is shining now it's 55 degrees today and the snow is finally starting to melt oh my gosh daylight savings time occurred and so i am just feeling the warmth i'm feeling the the spring summer vibes and my mood has begin begun to change um i don't know if some of you but do you guys get seasonal depression i feel like i am so depressed during the winter seasons um it's just dark we have very long winters here where i live very cold winters and i am just so happy that the sun is literally shining through and it's so warm i opened up the windows today to get some fresh air in and it just felt so amazing so y'all let me know down in the comment section what is your favorite season my favorite season is definitely spring summer i used to love winter but ever since i moved to where i am now it's kind of like in the mountains i absolutely hate winters you guys because we get so much snow and it is like zero below like negative 30 degrees at times and it is just freezing for absolutely no reason <laughs> um so y'all let me know down in the comment section what is your favorite season there's no going back no going back there's no going back to your own life living in the past we're over that 
I'm feeling it tonight Riding on the dizzying high Sunsets, remember the colors They were wrong, it was way more than a dream We climbed up, yeah, over the hillside So right, we stood there all wide-eyed You and I, floating on air in my mind My mind Cause there's no going back, no going back There's no going back to your own life Living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it Riding on the dizzying heights Y'all, my vacuum is just not sucking anything up. I don't know what is wrong with it. It is a newer vacuum. I just bought it like maybe last year sometime and it's just not working. And um, I had to go over my rugs with the broom, just sweeping stuff up because um, it was so dirty. And you'll see the amount of dirt that came out of my rug and off of my floors. Oh my goodness. It it is so bad so I definitely know I have to go through my entire home um, do do some spring cleaning for sure because it is absolutely filthy I am so disgusted um, at the dirt and the dust that came up off of my floors I can't even believe it and we don't even wear shoes in our home I don't know where it came from but it was almost like sand type of dust and dirt so I don't know where it came from but um, I just had to go over the floors and the rugs with the broom and it really did the trick you guys so if you're wondering why I'm sweeping when I already vacuumed this is the reason why even if you try you wouldn't understand it maybe something's missing inside of you just a bit of sugar to that heart Hold up, hold up, baby I can't sit beside you While you're going on about your simple life Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not So this is 
what the living room is looking like I love it so much you guys it is so bright and vibrant and happy and I love the pops of color I know the pink <laughs> I have my husband and my son here but they absolutely love it it's not a lot of pink it's just a tad bit of it but I love how I incorporated all of those colors and tones together from the, the drapes to the florals to the pillow coverings and just have like a neutral background I that's why I love decorating with neutrals as like my main decorating um aesthetic because I can add pops of colors here and there with every season so I just love that the way that it turned out I love that there is a bit of um you know whimsy to it but also you have a little bit of vintage traditional and a little bit of you know modern here and there so I just love the way that it looks um let me know down in the comment section what do you guys think uh about the outcome and and um, yeah, if you guys liked it, definitely give the video a thumbs up and share it with your peoples, your friends, co-workers, everyone that you know. Um, and don't forget that Jesus is Lord, that he loves you, and I love you too. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you on Friday with a spring house tour. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.
fams welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here so today I am going to be giving you guys a clean and decorate with me for the spring early summer um, the way that my home is decorated now is the way that it's going to be and I'm not touching it until fall <laughs> so let's go ahead and get the cleaning and get into this video so this little area right here that you saw the little green spot I was decorating the fireplace and there was some green foam that was in the bag and it, it fell out all on the carpet and so I needed to just vacuum it and also get this rug cleaned so that my rug will be nice and fresh and clean for the spring summer season I didn't go over the entire rug because it doesn't need cleaning but just that one little spot that was so like stained with the green and I was hoping and praying that it would come out and thank God that it did so now I am just going ahead and running the shampoo over it and this shampoo you guys is absolutely incredible I love it so so much um, it got all the stains out and more <laughs> so enjoy this clean with me and decorate with me video you guys and I'll pop back in in a little bit As you can see here I'm kind of switching out my florals um, I took my greenery from my white console table and put it over to the other side of the room and now I'm kind of just separating these um, white um, florals and putting them in this jar because I'm just trying to make the space lighter especially since my fireplace mantle is like BAM in your face so I'm trying not to add too much I don't want to overstimulate the senses um, and I think it looks good knowing me though I'll probably go around the house and take some things away or add some not add but take some things away but I think for now everything looks good it looks springy and it looks fresh I didn't want to add any more color to the space because the mantle itself is enough color for me <laughs> um, and so I thought that this looks really really nice and um, it feels like spring you guys please excuse the sounds the noise in the background that is Nyla she's upstairs in her bedroom so if you can still hear her I do apologize guys I want to give you this hack this tip design tip coffee table books are super expensive we know this right so what I did was I ordered some restoration hardware catalogs they're completely free I ordered a bunch of them and I use them here on my coffee table because you know I didn't want to spend 30 40 bucks on a coffee table book can you imagine how many coffee table books you would have to literally buy to make your coffee table or just anywhere in your home just looks nice so this is my hack for you restoration hardware or any um, home decor store catalog that you love go ahead and order them they are free they will ship them to you within two to three weeks and you can use them to decorate your space
I thought these, you know, floral arrangements was just way too much. It was like overly stimulating for me. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and take the baby breaths out and just leave the white jar. I think I might actually like just take a lot of stuff away in a little bit. I don't know. It's, it seems like it's a lot going on in one space, <laughs> but, um, you let me know down below if you think the space is overly decorated. Um, I wasn't trying to do it overly, you know, to over decorate or anything, but you know, I just wanted the space to feel cozy and cottagey and warm. My family loves it. So I guess it looks fine and I did a good job. now we are moving on to the pillows I eliminated a lot of pillows you guys because these recliners they don't give you much space for pillows I feel like if there's one pillow on this on the chair you're literally falling off when you sit down so I had to just try to eliminate a lot of the pillows which saddens me because y'all know I love my pillows but I think that they turned out really well and it looks as you know springy as much as it's gonna look um, plus you know I have kids they're home for spring break summertime is coming I don't want to just crowd the, the couches with too many pillows I want everyone to be comfortable so okay guys so this beautiful candle warmer lamp um, I was sent it was sent to me I'm sorry it was sent to me by um, I can't even pronounce the name but I'm gonna spell it T R T Y L D T um, and it was sent to me by them and asked if I can review it for you guys and y'all know I already own a candle warmer lamp and I absolutely love it but y'all this one is so pretty it has like a little glam factor it has the wood and everything y'all gonna see what I'm talking about it is absolutely beautiful um, and they packaged it so well like it came it wasn't broken or anything like that and I just appreciate that <laughs> so here it is you guys in all its glory it's absolutely beautiful I love the black and all of the um like the wood feature and i also love like that dome um you know circular shape of the the shade or you know the dome cover it cover i couldn't get that out <laughs> it is adjustable and it has its own like plug-in feature you can um dim it you can go to the lowest dimmable um light or the highest and it also has a timer so you can set it to um for two hours four hours or eight hours i have mine on two hours um and you put a candle of the under there of your choosing and it just smells the entire room up in it oh my gosh it's so beautiful it's also very affordable you guys i will have the link down below for you guys where you can go and shop this lamp on their amazon store and yeah let me know down in the comment section if you guys are liking it and what do you guys think i love it and of course y'all gonna see it in my videos because it is going to be on all the time it also comes with two um bulbs i'm using one of them now and then i have an extra bulb um you know for whenever it goes out so i am just really really loving it um it is just it, it makes the house look so beautiful like an ambient lighting and it also you know melts the the candle so great and i don't have to light it i don't have to light it y'all know i have kids and i don't like to use candles per se light candles in my home so this was just great so thank you so much for working with me on this video and yeah i hope you guys like it and thank you guys for watching today and i hope that you got some inspiration from this decorating with me for spring and for summer because y'all know i am not decorating again for summer this is it <laughs> so i hope you guys have a good day and i will see you guys in the next episode thank you guys so much for watching remember that jesus is lord he loves you and i love you too i will see you guys next time
बाय